Hi everyone and welcome back to Dream Daddy. Now unfortunately we had technical issues so we've ended up back here with Robert on the, the street of Street Town and I believe <laughs> I'm here with Susie and Steph. I sneezed too hard. <laughs> oh, no, Hello. You're... Right and uh, darling could you please recite your lines once more? <laughs> Me. Um, you know, do you want to come inside or not? <laughs> A wave of realization rushes over me. I blush. Uh, okay, um, one of three. We're doing uh, this by... Hmm? Uh, we're doing random, random number generator and it's come up as two. Smell and nod. Let's do it. Smell oh no, boy, smell nerd. <laughs> I follow him up to his door. He fumbles with his keys for a second and unlocks the door, leading me inside. The moment the door closes behind us, he pushes me up against the wall and kisses me, grabbing my hips. <laughs> Come on! Oh my takes god! Takes my hand and leads me upstairs to where he keeps his domain sauce. Luigi, I have a case. Do not come in. <laughs> and to what I assume is okay, the okay, brother. But it's dark. It's like the back cave. And I can't see anything but Robert's intense expression. It's very frightening. He kisses me again and I can hear him shucking off his jacket. I come to the... <laughs> I know! Like, I, I had to pause. I was like, wait, what? Elf men to his hands roam down my chest. Suddenly he's tugging at my belt, sucking it. Um, I, I, I don't normally do this. Do you want to stop? Oh, sorry. Um, <laughs> go. One. Actually, uh, I should probably get going. Hello, Sora. You come to join All us? Alright. I think Hi, I'm gonna baby. head home. Sorry. Like, come on, baby. Ah, it's so cool. Come on. Uh, Vida said, I head home. My head's still spinning yeah. inside, turning Robert down. The side of the couch helps me compartmentalize. Though, and before I know it, I'm having dreams about teeth falling out. Hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. We had this last time. Ah! There's the duck! It returns. I wake up with an unknown number. Rise and shine, El early bird. Still wanna work out? This is Craig by the BTW. Smile face. <laughs> Holy crap, it's 6 a.m. Oh Who God. does 6 a.m. anymore? Stop realizing it, I drift back to sleep. <laughs> me, 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 me. Whoops, I must have winked at back there. Oh, I check my phone again. Hey, bud! Still wanna get your squall on? I'm ready to tear up the track. Hit me up! God, the last thing I want to do right now is work out. But it is quick. I do want to catch up. Alright, and just waiting for the number generator to load. And two! Hey man, uh, I need a few minutes to wake up, but let's meet in 20. After a few seconds, an alarm text comes in. Sure thing! Meet me at the gym! I stretch and my bones bleed. I gotta stop falling asleep on the couch. I throw my blanket and hey wait, I don't remember falling asleep with a blanket. Amanda must have helped me after I fell asleep. Bless that child. I reluctantly brush my teeth, throw on my, the only clothes I own that are even kind of gym appropriate and head out. The neighbourhood is quiet and the city this early in the morning. Birds chirp and the grass is still wet with dew. Surprisingly the gym is pretty crowded. I spot Craig standing out front, stretching, of course. He spots and me and waves. Enthusiastic. Oh. Hey, bro! Good morning! <laughs> hey, it's uh, good to see you, man. It's definitely not as pumped up as he is. Maybe I should have had some coffee before I left. Mm -hmm. You ready to kick some butt? Oh, 
Hold on. Sorry, I have husband messaging me at the same time. <laughs> Complicated. I know. Uh, it came up three. I don't think he likes this. This is it. This is how I die. <laughs> oh, uh, no. It'll be alright, dude. We'll ease you into it. Hey. <laughs> we head to the gym and I'm majorly intimidated. All these people look like they could break me in half, and it seems like Craig is friends with all of them. Mm -hmm. He high fives and finger guns all the cool jocks in the room. They look like they could <laughs> and would steal my lunch money to spend on protein shakes. Mm. <laughs> Come on, but let's warm up. <laughs> Alrighty. We head over to the treadmills and start walking. Okay, I can walk. Walking is good. This is a decent place to be <laughs> walking. <laughs> uh, so I know we are on treadmills. Hmm. Yes! And those over there are <laughs> ellipticals. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Very good! What? You will not be the first to die! What is well. all that <laughs> other stuff? <laughs> Hey. <laughs> they might look a little scary, but I guarantee that all of them serve a specific purpose for building muscle man. Dude! I watch as a dude in muscle T flexes a muscle I didn't know existed on a machine. I think was once used to process grain into flour. What is that? Why is that guy doing that to himself? That's a good question, bro. What do you think he's doing? <laughs> That's okay. but we'll wait and see. Uh, one. I love the bar dancer praying to some sort of being god. Yep. <laughs> he's, uh, he's trying to make his thighs so strong that he could crush people's skulls with them. Yes. Hey! Yeah, that's pretty much the only reason I work out. <laughs> <laughs> eggplants! <laughs> oh no, cake is <laughs> giving me eggplants. Turning up the speed of air to the same. Uh, <laughs> how long have you been doing this buffing? Couple of years. And what do you know do you do when you're not dating or working or buffing? Oh. oh. I coach my twin softball team. <laughs> that still counts as dadding and buffing. <laughs> yeah! Uh, I keep busy. What do you do for fun? <laughs> oh my god, hold on. Uh, 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 number three. I spend most of my time in front of the mirror admiring my Adonis like figure that I've worked on. So far, this cold. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, he likes it. But that, I mean, lay horizontal and watch better. Mm -hmm. We're jogging now. Yeah. Oh god, we're jogging now. I look over to Craig, <laughs> who hasn't even broken a sweat. How is he doing this so effortlessly? I'm dying. I can feel my life force draining through every orifice of my body. Mm. Hey. Remember when my fish died in college? I killed it. No, I don't <laughs> like this story. <laughs> oh my god, is he really bumping up the speed again? I guess I better do it too. Ah, oh, this is fast. This is very, very fast. Oh. And we were at that party, and you vowed to make me feel better. You tell me to create a distraction. So of course I do a sick keg stand and get everyone cheering. And then I, <laughs> then if I steal fish from the fish tank, I have to party with my bare hands like I need it. Hey. <laughs> and then you drop the fish and it flop it around, so you panic. So you run up to me post keg stand with a dying dirty fish in your hand. Then you stop off the ground. And you're yelling at me that we have to leave. Dude! So we're running out of that threat party with a fish and trying to give it mouth to mouth resuscitation. 
and we get them home and get them in a bowl of water, but the prognosis was like grim. And then I fucked your wife! And the next day, uh, <laughs> alive and well. Hey! They never did catch the great fish thieves of Grand Ridge U. They're so <laughs> weird, man. <laughs> and yep. They never. Well, I shoot off the end of the treadmill and crash into the wall. Jesus, that hurts. Hey! Dude! <laughs> Are you okay? Craig offers me a hand and looks me over for injuries. I'm, I'm fantastic. Oh my god, my spine. Hey, hey, hey. I feel fantastic. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I managed to stand up and rub my back. It doesn't hurt now, but I'm sure of a letter. Oh. Yep. You don't have to push yourself like that. Always know your limits, bro! <laughs> Any? Well, uh, I think I might call our gym adventure here. Hmm. You sure? Yeah. Mm -hmm. For the love of God, yes. <laughs> Alright, well here, I brought you this! Craig hands me a shaker bottle full of thick green liquid. I stare at it with what must be apparent distaste. Mm -hmm. What are you it's... doing on my swamp? <laughs> Get out of my swamp, it's you swamp. I got oh. it from Shrek's swamp when it was okay. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, uh, thank you for that. Oh my god. Uh, I'm, I'm really glad you shared this dirty water with me. He wants me to drink it. Oh boy, here goes. I take a salsa. It's actually delicious. Wow, that is actually really good. Dude. Well, there you go. And good for you. <laughs> <laughs> it's my hey. special recipe. I'm pretty proud of it. Let me know if you ever want to work out again. Maybe we can try running around the neighborhood if treadmills aren't your beat. No pun intended, bro. Oh, okay. well, hey, Sora. Good one. Uh, well, I'm gonna go put some ice on this. Everything. Uh, I'll see you around, yeah. Keep it away from me. I leave the gym feeling ashamed. Craig used to order lemonade from the pizza place across the street from our dorm. And now he can run circles around me. Literally, man, I really got to work on this dad abode. I get home and lie down on the couch. It hurts to move. Oh, God, I'm so old. <laughs> oh no, I must have fallen asleep. What time is this? Shit, it's 3.55. I'm supposed to be at Manda's school in five minutes. I frantically pull on some clean clothes, apply a generous amount of deodorant and run out the door. Bump. Oh, I remember now. I arrive at Amanda's school and check in the front desk. They gave me a bright orange whisper sticker and send me on my way. Early awake and feeling pretty haggard, but hopefully no one will notice. Uh -huh. I check my watch and I'm relieved to see that I'm only two minutes late. Wait, was it room 103? 108? I spotted you standing at the locker. I approach him for help, knowing I'm fucked, but I'll do it anyway. Um, yep. Excuse me, uh, do you know where Mr. Vega's classroom is? The youth turns around and looks me up and down with heavily flamed eyes. Oh boy, here we go. Come on, kid. I'm late for a meeting. Mr. Hill. Mr. <laughs> Vega. <clears throat> I don't know. Have you tried the exit? Okay, wise guy. Are you gonna help me or not? <sighs> right up those stairs and to the left. Can't miss him. You lying piece of potato. I head up the stairs yes. and walk around. I'm about to find Mr. Vega's <laughs> class anyway. Searching, I head back down stairs. That punk you sent me on a wild goose chase. I don't like it. I get back to where the <laughs> low red jar is standing, fully ready to give him a piece of my mind. When suddenly a head pops out of the classroom next to the lock. Oh. Lucian, don't you have a fault? <laughs> yeah. That's right. <laughs> Fine, Mr. Vega. 
Oh. Now I'm officially 10 minutes late. I glare at him as he walks away. You low red Gerald way. We are not <laughs> cool. Oh. <laughs> oh. Must be Azawa. This period mind waiting in the back. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mr. Vega leads me in, and I can take a seat in one of the complex motion desks in the back. I might get stuck in this. Hmm? <laughs> Alright, we are where we now tell me about the unreliability of the na narrator and the, the challenges capture and the ride. I'm scared. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yes. stands up and does that thing where he blows into the crook of his eyeball and makes a fart noise. Well, dude, you're a fart. Ah. Uh. Clash her ups in laughter. Yes, Colin's a fart. Um, yes. Great, great, everybody. Very funny, Colin. Sit down. Oh. You fuck wit. You fart. Colin Caulfield is an unreliable narrator in the sense that <laughs> the bell for the end of the period rings. All of a sudden, <laughs> my accent must change dramatically, and I must have a roll in my arms like this. All of my students immediately get up and make a break for the door. What? I remember to do the aid and answer response <laughs> questions. One and then four in your text. Nobody's listening. Do mm -hmm. it. <laughs> Not I guess. <laughs> Mr. Vega <laughs> turns to me and sighs. Hmm. Huh. Middle schoolers, right? Don't right. you teach high schoolers? Hmm. You know, budget cut. Mm. Ah, right, okay. Oh. Thanks so much for coming in. This is the episode where everyone goes Scottish for no reason. <laughs> Aye. Uh, no problem, Mr. Vega. <coughs> Do you want a Glasgow kiss or a smoochie? Uh, fuck off. Fuck <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> Google? I don't know. I don't normally do anything. But as I'm sure you know, Amanda's a very bright student and I'm concerned about her. What's, uh, what's going on? Eh. Amanda has never been the most engaged student, but I know she really That's because she's single. <laughs> she's been behind. She's not assignment and I'm doing rather Yes, I'd normally chop to sing like to sing. Mm. This is strange. I thought Amanda always shared everything with me. I hadn't crossed, even crossed my mind that something might be wrong. I don't know. It's like she's a teenager! I just wanted to ask, is everything okay? I love you. Okay. Enter uh, Susie with the random number generator. Hold on. Let me see. Number two. Oh, not again. Can we, like. I've, I see this. Do you want to do it again? Please. Because last time yeah, I felt I really bad. As someone who studies what I study, I couldn't, I couldn't consciously deal with that. Alright, it's done number three. And everyone that hates me because of this, I'm sorry, but haha, I have power. I hadn't yes. <laughs> noticed anything different about her, but she always tends to put on a happy face, no matter what. Hmm. See, if you approve it, I know she value as I do, but I'm really sure you're getting as she keeps heading down this road. I'm so happy with this answer. Last time we played this before it glitched out. And um, we picked she's fine because the number generator and sadness happens. Uh, <laughs> I know how it didn't up is and I would hate to be on a ship. Hey, that's really there. Oh my 
make sure to talk to Amanda. Thanks for letting me know, Hugo. Sorry, I, I slip into the Scottish accent out of nowhere sometimes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Any time. <laughs> On my way out, I stop thinking for a moment. I turn to Hugo. Hey, Hugo. Ah. Yes. You ever catch the ride? Hmm? Yes. He likes that answer. That That's is a very. You guys trip me up. I try and do it, but I can't do it because, like, so... <laughs> all right, okay. I leave the classroom and make my way out to school. I'm a little bit in shock that Amanda was able to hide this so well from me. She always been such a force of positivity in my life, especially after we lost her mother. What a great girl. That was ca that was careless of you losing your mother. Yeah, ah, it returns. <laughs> Amanda must be done with classes for the day by now. I'm sure she would appreciate a ride home. And maybe I can talk to her about what's going on. Yeah, I feel Scottish again. I know it happens. Maybe, just maybe. <laughs> In actual fact, I'd like to tell everyone about my character. Like, at one point, I was Scottish. I was staying in Scotland and then I moved to this place and I tried to change it up but that's my fake accent this is my real one so I pull up into the car pool and Amanda hops into the car you need the real one yeah because it's easier to do so that's what I'm going to do okay here we go so did you have fun gossiping about me? Mr Vega and I actually just gossiped about other celebrity crushes yes so you talked about Mario Batali the whole time the chef yes it is uh it, oh, 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 oh yeah okay all right i need to say scottish or american <laughs> guys pick for me and i'll stick scottish it. It, oh, scottish it was a very productive meeting eh? there you go i'm pretty hungry can we grab some dinner sure thing all right between i've got a different number generator that seems to work a lot better okay number one Well, I think with our powers combined, we could throw together a gourmet meal. Where's the of the food channel? No, you can't. There's <laughs> that demon again. I don't know about that, but I can promise you it will at least be edible. Yeah. That's the spirit. Oh. We drive in silence for a short while. Amanda plays the game on her phone, I think. Get off your phone, you millennial. I should say something. <laughs> You know, sometimes when a kid gets older, they try. Uh, well, they f uh, they find that they have to keep things hidden from their parents, and that's okay because sometimes that's what kids do. Is it bad that I automatically mess up my own dialect there? And I'm <laughs> I know you. You almost went into Italian right in the middle of it. I don't know what happened, and that's okay because. It happened again. But also, <laughs> it's sometimes it's good to have the parents' perspective because, you know, so maybe the parents have also dealt with similar situations. Hmm. And maybe they're a little cooler than you give them credit for. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is that it's good to share. Love you. By the way, like, I'm just going to say, like, this whole playthrough will be me in a crisis of nationality. <laughs> It's okay, we'll keep you right. Have you been reading my tweets? You have a Twitter? Huh? What? Never mind. Look, sweetie, Mr. Vega said you haven't been participating in class and that you're not, like, turning up, well, turning things in, mm -hmm. child. Unacceptable in my <laughs> Oh, I'm fine, Pops. Seen you right to said all that. I thought you liked Mr. Vega's class. Hmm. It's fine. He's fine. I am the devil. We pull up in a stoplight, and I, I, Amanda, still texting. Just, I want you to know that you can talk to me about anything. Oh. Haha. <laughs> Frustrating. Uh, I heard Emma are going to a fancy art school in Catherine. That's exciting. 
Was I meant to be California instead of Kofun? Yes. <laughs> okay. Stay in America. Kofun. Kofun. That's not what I said. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It came across as Kofun. <laughs> I was trying my best to imitate a Scottish accent even though I have one. <laughs> ah, California. You kind of said anyway. it like a little bit like weird. Yeah. I know. <laughs> oh, it was just so cute. It's like. I think your friend's going to kiss him. <laughs> <laughs> right, children. <laughs> okay, okay. Yep. Are you bummed that you guys aren't going to the same school in California? There you go. <laughs> yep. Huh? California. Amanda keeps <laughs> texting. She staff us a laugh, and I'm thinking I'm dropping into Diana, and I'm thinking I'd laugh. <laughs> Does anyone want to do a Scottish accent for the dead and save me from this hell? <laughs> There's Diane. What's so funny? Uh, it's a, I don't think you'd get it. Yes, she will. Okay. Uh, <laughs> accent. Huh. Noah. Who's Noah? A friend. Does he uh, go to your school? <sighs> yep. Do you <laughs> like Noah? Hey. Fucking hate him. What? <laughs> no. Dad. Uh, I can't believe you would. Oh. Dad. <laughs> I mean, jeez. <laughs> Be so fucking quiet. Aww. Why would you? Uh, Chris. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Just asking. Just asking. Oh my god. <clears throat> yeah, he's just my friend. I do love it. This music plays so well. <laughs> Does. Guys and girls can be friends. He's my friend. And mm. fuck buddy. Okay, okay. <laughs> Cheese. This is uh, going well. Well, uh, aye, uh, good talk, love your kiddo, you strange hermit. She leaves <laughs> forward and turns up the radio, I guess. This conversation is over and I'm quite glad for that. Let's get out of this car of multilinguist. Amanda and I uh -huh. get back home and start cooking some dinner. <laughs> or dindins. <laughs> uh, dindins, yes. <laughs> I found, I found this artisanal mac and cheese recipe online that I've been dying to try. Uh, artisanal. There's two ingredients to mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Uh. Dad, please try and enjoy the finer things in life. I think you of all people should be able to appreciate what, what one can do with cheese. <laughs> Plus it has bacon oh, in it. I it is yummy! I want this. <laughs> Aren't we, uh, as a society, collectively over bacon? Oh. Get the fuck out. <laughs> bacon never... I'm sorry, bacon is life. <laughs> bacon never stopped being good. It just has a PR problem. Oh. Uh, we get to work on the recipe. Amanda measuring things out and handing them to me, stumping a bowl so I can feel useful. And it's really yes, interesting can. that my natural dialect has now become so hard for me to stick to. Amanda <laughs> puts me into baking duty, so I chop a bunch of whatever and uh, toss it in a pan to get it sizzling. Now, when you think of Scottish accents, don't think of Mel Gibson. He doesn't do it well. But <laughs> that's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> oh my god. The key to good mac and cheese is a balance of texture and flavor. Pops, not only are we gonna want the full what? Not only are we gonna want the fullness of the cheese and bacon, but we also need to counterbalance it with the crunchy full feel of breadcrumbs. I'm sorry I'm yelling. Check on the bacon or a mouthfeel. <laughs> mouthfeel uh, Oh my god. I want uh, my mouth. <laughs> Number one. Check on the bacon. Check on the bacon. It's uh, still pink and rubbery. I give the pieces a little star. Yeah. <laughs> uh, wait. What's um mouthfeel? <laughs> Please explain, Amanda. 
you know, when you eat stuff and it, the texture... <laughs> Listen, I've been watching a lot of the Food Channel and I honestly don't know what it means. It just makes me feel sophisticated to say, No, it doesn't! No, no. I get that. Every time I watch that channel, I just feel... And all they're hungry, jealous, insecure about my cooking ability. And then hungry again. Yes, this is yep. how I feel. <laughs> That's pretty much it. I like the mouth feel of that sentence. Oh my god. <laughs> I've, I've raised a mini me. Amanda, yes, I feel have. isn't just about food. It's about the words that are fun to say. Gregarious. Oh dear oh. lord. One of Hold on. One four. four. Uh, one. Uh, what, the, what is lenticular? Lenticular. lenticular. I've heard of that one before. I can't remember what it means. Cattywampus. <laughs> Number four. Check on the bacon. Uh, the bacon is sizzling away. It smells good too. Ah, bacon. I give that sucker a flip and I want that in my mouth. No. In my nice. belly! I want that in my belly! <laughs> <laughs> Good work, Dad. Bacon can easily overheat and cause a grease fire. I'm proud of you for remaining vigilant. We literally just moved in here. I'm dead set on not burning this place down. I was like a hawk. <laughs> Amanda finishes up with the mac and cheese and I toss the bacon bits in there. After stirring it all together, I took a taste. Taste. Mm. How's the mouse feel? That is what I'm going to do from now on. <laughs> Alright. Uh, uh, uh. Number one. Scrumptious. <laughs> Amanda tries a spoonful. Is it lovely, madame? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, that's pretty scrumptious. We settle in on the couch with... Our rolls of mac and cheese. Oh, cool! Long Haul Ice Road Paranormal Ghost Truckers is on. Your favorite, right? <laughs> oh hell yeah! <laughs> they have to make it over the Canadian tundra, t tundra before the ice road melts. But also, they're hunting ghosts. Yeah. Also, the trucks are haunted. This is an episode I've always seen, but it's one of the best. Callum and Flint, Dogbone. <laughs> The twin brother truck driving and ghost hunting duo find themselves in the greatest peril yet. Which one of them farted? Oh no! The ghost done got control of the truck. I can't steer steer on them. They're <laughs> dead. <laughs> Let, Let me use. This... Oh, sorry, on you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me use the CVP meter to try and communicate with the spirits. Lynn, we're about to die! Ah, almost got it! If you listen carefully, it sounds like it's saying you're gonna die! Huh? That's because we're about to die, you! <laughs> Where's Diana? <laughs> <laughs> this is art. This is where Diana just haunts us all. The episode Diana. ends and Amanda excuses herself. See, don't do that accent or I get stuck no. in it. It's myself <laughs> to go and start arguments on the internet and I'm trying not to listen to the two people that accompany me on this. I stay up a little longer, curious about the exploits of Callum and Flint Dogbone after the disastrous ice the road accident. Afterward, I crawl into bed and get a good night's sleep. And with that, I'm gonna save. Because I don't save this game regularly enough to get through it. No, so, no you don't. I'm gonna get say, I'll be the same. And good night. Say goodbye, ladies. Au revoir. Goodbye. Au revoir. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Au revoir, goodbye. <laughs>